Do you want to load custom fonts onto your Optin Monster campaigns? Custom fonts allow you to maintain brand cohesiveness throughout your whole website. And with Optin Monster, it's easy. In this video, we'll show you two simple methods to load custom fonts onto your Optin Monster campaigns. Let's get started. Method number one is to add fonts with custom CSS. Your first step is to go to Adobe Fonts and type in your custom font that you would like to display on your Optin Monster campaign. Then click on View Family, and that will take you to the custom fonts page where you can look at the different styling of that font, such as italic, light, etc. Then you'll need to toggle Activate 10 Fonts, and you'll see a success message, and you can just click OK. Next, you'll need to click on the Add to Web Project link, and this will open a dialog box, which will allow you to set up your web project with your custom font. So just enter in a project name, and then you can press the blue Create button. And that will bring up a piece of code that you can use in the head tag of your HTML on your website. So simply go to your web platform and you can paste that in to the head section of your code. If you have a WordPress site, there's an alternative way to do this. Scroll down to plugins and click on add new. Then type in Adobe fonts under the search plugins field. And once you hit enter, you can click on install now and make sure to activate the custom Adobe fonts type kit plugin. Once you have the plugin installed and activated, scroll up to appearance and you can click on Adobe fonts. This will bring you to your custom font page. And all you have to do is go and get the project ID from Adobe fonts. This can be found under the web projects tab of the font that you just selected under Adobe fonts. So go back and paste that in and save. This will successfully have saved your custom font onto your WordPress site. Next, head over to Optin Monster to create your campaign and select the campaign type and template you'd like to use. Next, name your campaign, select which site to load on, and you can start building. To load the custom fonts onto your campaign, you need to go to the left-hand side of the menu and go to Optin Settings, and then click on Custom CSS. Here, you're going to paste in some custom code, and the code is on Optin Monster's blog. So all you have to do is copy that code snippet and change the campaign ID and font family. And to do that easily, I used an online code editor and just Googling online code editor will bring you up several options and simply paste in the campaign ID, which you can see on your campaign dashboard right underneath your campaign. So you can just copy that, paste it into the code snippet and change the name of your font family to the one that you selected with Adobe fonts. In this case, it will be the Josephine Sands font family. And I'll simply paste that in and highlight that new code snippet, and that's what we're going to be pasting in to the custom CSS in Optin Monster. So make sure that you save that, and to check out how it will look on your website, go to the Publish tab and click on Preview Changes. Here you can see the campaign with the Josephine Sands custom font loaded onto our Optin Monster campaign. Next, we'll show you the next method about how to load custom fonts using custom JavaScript. To get the code snippet that you'll need to edit, go to Optin Monster's blog that you can see here. There will be a link in the video description and copy this. And we're going to need to go back to our Adobe font web project and we're going to highlight the project ID. Now back in the Optin Monster app, you'll need to go to Optin settings in the home screen menu and under opt-in settings, click on custom JavaScript. Here you'll paste in the code that you just got from Optin Monsters blog. And we're going to need to highlight and replace the project ID on the code. The final step is to go back to opt-in settings and custom CSS and paste in the same code that you used for method one. So simply paste that in, save, and then you can go to the publish tab click on preview campaign and you've successfully loaded custom fonts onto your campaign using custom CSS and custom JavaScript. Check out our video on how to make a creative pop-up to increase your conversions even more. 
And to find out more about what OptinMonster can do for you, check out our demo. And don't forget to subscribe for more OptinMonster videos, the channel dedicated to getting you more conversions, email subscribers, and sales.